There's the procession onto the pitch at Werner Park tonight. Union Omaha and Central Valley Fuego with the Owls trying to make it 10 wins in a row. Here is how they line up. They're starting 11 presented by Rotella's Italian Bakery, and it's an unchanged 11 from their 3-2 win at Chattanooga last weekend. They in intend to continue to build and uh, rebuild from this season. Here we go. Can the Owls make it 10 in a row and extend their record, or will Fuego spark a shock with their first victory in two months during this winning run? Ball stayed in play for Acoff. Has Luis Heal with him. Now Acoff to the end line. His cutback. There's Burrito, and he flashed it just over the bar. Almost an ideal start for Omaha. As there's the danger that Dion Acoff poses down the wing. Get on with it quickly. Herrera wide to Vasquez. Into the box it goes. Lawal trying to get turned. Cutis Lawal wide as Nuhu makes the save. Almost an instant impact. The Owls have so many effective corner kick routines, and most of them stem from Connor Doyle's delivery. Drills it in. Two skiers. JP Skiers at the post. Crazy sequence. A big part of why he's so effective from those situations. Dion Akoff again down that right side. Akoff stands up another. It's Brito again and didn't quite catch it. Easy save for Paul Lewis. And Heal rides that challenge so deftly, but then tackled back by Cerritos. And Cerritos looks to slip in. Cutis Lawal. It's Nuhu again. It's loose. It's Forbes. It's chaos. It's scrambled away. Somehow it stays out. And Heal. See Fuego committing more white shirts to that side to try to shut off that service. But another ball into the box. Attacked by Dolabella. Who just missed. Long for Lawal. Lawal trying to race onto the end of it. Cutis Lawal again is denied by Rashid Nuhu, who's way out of his area. It's Forbes. And now taken back by Milanese. And again, the Owls survive. For the Owls, Dion Akoff, who caused lots of problems down that right side of the first half. We'll see how far he's able to go. Here's Dos Santos now. It's heel. It's heel straight at Paul Lewis on those other two sides. Here's Heal. And Dolabella has Dos Santos to aim for and finds Dos Santos. Back to goal. Akoff now hanging it up. Dolabella touched over the bar. Had to be by Paul Lewis. An awkward one for the goalkeeper. Akoff is basically a human trebuchet in the first half. Dos Santos back post. Dos Santos onto the roof of the net. Cerritos has an overlapping run. It's Billy Forbes, and Billy Forbes denied by Nuhu. Second ball is in, and Central Valley have that first goal. Taken by Doyle. And all the way through, did that cross the line? No, it did not. It's given straight back to Kunga, however. Meza. Akoff. Surrounded by a white wall, but slides to Dolabella, who back heels from Meza, who equalizes for Omaha. <laughs> Tremendous goal. Parity restored. Hope revived. Confidence built. 1-1 with 13 minutes to play. It was a sweetly constructed goal. Look at the back heel from Dolabella. Look at the left-footed finish from Meza. He doesn't normally score with his left. He's usually a right footer, but he opened himself up and steered it unerringly into the side netting, leaving Paul Lewis, who's been excellent tonight. Dolabella swinging wildly at it, pings it into the box, chested down. It comes for Akoff. Pulled back, Gallardo. Joe Gallardo, they've got it! Turnaround complete. Ten in a row in sight. The Owls, who trailed 1-0, lead 2-1 in stoppage time. Akoff pulled it back. Gallardo took one touch out of his feet and curled it into that far corner. He didn't need a second invitation, and Paul Lewis could do nothing about it. Joe Gallardo off the bench, into the dog pile.